With the first pick in the 2012 NFL Draft, the Indianapolis Colts select Andrew Luck, quarterback, Stanford. There we go. He's got to hang up with his boss and hug his mom. A neat moment for a young man of a former quarterback of the National Football League, a former quarterback teammate of Peyton Manning's dad, Archie. He is now getting the pin. His mom is pinning him with the blue horseshoe and the handshakes are all around. As what we've been talking about all last season is Peyton Manning sat out for the Colts, wondering who the Colts would select, what would happen with Peyton Manning's future, what would happen with the number one overall pick should Indianapolis get it. We are finally here on draft night at Marshall Falk. Peyton Manning's successor is, in fact, Andrew Luck. Quick slant. certainly isn't how I uh, envision this or plan this, uh, but, but I am going to retire. Roz, my reaction was now, Stephen A, now, listen, it's an individual decision. John points out all the factors, you point out all the factors, the physical toll this took on Andrew Luck, and that's an individual man's decision, I have to respect it. I he was desperate, I mean, you got to say, at the very least, the guy's desperate, he wants to play, he came off and missing a year, and goes to the playoffs, right? Mm -hmm. They say bigger things are happening for Indianapolis this year, you don't think that he wanted to play, that he did well, everything well, 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 he well. possibly could to get ready for this season? Well, plus you're looking at the Indianapolis Colts, and one could make the argument that even though they've been in an AFC Championship game before, John, this is the best chance they've had at a Super Bowl. Yeah. You acquired Funches, you still got T.Y. Hilton, Marlon Mack is your right. running back, all right? You got Ebron as your tight end, you got an offensive line that's just rife with monsters who are committed to protecting him. This is like a tragedy, you know, this is really sad. I mean, I can't understand, you know, well, I should have retired a couple months ago. What? This guy was desperate to play. And the only way I see out uh, is, is to, to no longer play football. Uh, it's it's taken my joy of this game away, uh, and uh, this.
things are. Every time I sit on that couch, I feel like you lecture me eventually. I bet that we could have made this work and probably would have figured things out. But I guess I'm a letdown, but it's cool, I checked out. Oh, you wanna be friends now? Okay, let's put my fake face on and pretend now. Sit around and talk about the good times. That didn't even happen. I mean, why are you laughing? Must have missed that joke. Let me see if I can find a reaction. No, but at least you're happy. It's like we're on the edge right now. I'm so sorry. 